home decorators often talk about mixing and contrasting textures, and one seasonal accessory has it in combo. We're taking a closer look at the magic of using, and even mixing and matching, rattan and glass. Interior designer Sarah Grover is here to explain and get us going. It's so good to see you. Thanks, fun to I be back. Your store is a fun place to be this time it of year. It is a fun place. Fall, right? It Fall. just brings on all the things. So a new accessory is jumping off store shelves. Yes. What is everyone loving? So glass with rattan and caning and wicker, either together, kind of like this piece right here, uh -huh. or separated, but either the accessory of the caning and the wicker and rattan or the glass, and you can combine it and you can play with it. It just, it feels fallish. Yes, it does. Especially with that color of the caning and the wicker. Mm -hmm. It brings out that element of just fall and fun. And the glass, you can you can choose a lot of different colors, especially those fun fall colors. It's kind of a juxtaposition, too, in the sense that the glass is shiny. You could say sophisticated. Yes. Rattan can be elevated in style, but it almost has that rustic texture to it as well. Yeah, yeah, that natural element. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. we like them together. Yes. You've got some props behind you. You're going to yeah. show us how to dress our tables, dress our homes, our shelves. Yeah, we're going to have some fun. In updated ways. Um, what's your rule of thumb for styling rattan? Okay, so right here, I've placed a glass piece with some rattan and then this face. Now, I love adding stems, if you okay. have that rattan glass face. Uh -huh. Right here, I place some stems. And then over here, this yeah. could be your coffee table, your dining table, your kitchen island. Yeah. So cloches are so fun, especially cloches with that rattan base. Look at that. So fun. What a cute piece. And you can put things inside, depending on the season. So we're it's wanting fun. to balance that texture with some other tones, right? Yes. Some other materials. Yep. So separating the two. Mm -hmm. So if let's say you go and get some accessories where you have some wicker and glass and maybe they're not together. Right. I'm gonna switch out a couple sure, looks and sure. show you. I love so, watching her brain work. This is fun. So we have some cute wicker acorn baskets that are just perfect for fall. Okay. So let's take these candlesticks out. Replace it with these Those fun baskets. baskets. Are adorable. Yes. And then we're gonna take these off because we wanna put something just a little different okay. to balance that wicker. That's the balance you're talking about. Yes. So these glass faces, I love. I love the shape. Look at the meanness. I love the color, yes. Yeah. And then placing some fun fall florals that go with that green. Balance is really nice. Now over here on the coffee table, uh -huh. if we were to take this off, Grab this, look how pretty this wicker tray. Oh, that's gorgeous. Love this wicker tray. That really speaks to fall. Uh-huh. We'll take this off. How can I be your handy dandy assistant? You know, assistant? why don't you grab this? I would love to. And let's put that right on that tray. Okay. Look at us at work. We're girls at work. Yeah, we're having we're busy fun girls, styling. We're like three-year-old likes to say, busy girls. Yeah, and then these gorgeous amber bottles. I am smitten with Aren't amber glass. Aren't these cute? Yeah, it's really pretty. I love them. We added a fun floral in the taller mm -hmm. one, maybe we'll put that in the back. And amber glass, maybe not something I would reach for year round, but come fall, I mean, hello, it doesn't get any better than that totally. tone and that color. Yeah, so the wicker with the glass, same thing over here, you're kind of balancing it off. So pretty. It's a fun look. Yeah, how are you choosing your stems and your full florals? So for the everyday spring, maybe something a little more green, so something like this that yeah. we started with. Yeah. And then for fall, just switching them out with something with a little more color, you mentioned moody, like those moody dark colors. Mm -hmm. Those are really fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how many to make it look full and balanced? I would say, you know, some people don't use enough, okay. but then you don't want to use too many. So I'd say at least four. Yeah. But the thing with stems is you can really bend them. So a few can go a long way. If you make it look a little more full. If you play and kind of yeah, move around. Yeah, play with it. And then with the smaller items, I mean, it's easy to make a statement here and go mm -hmm. bigger, go home. Generous is our generosity is our friend when it comes to decorating. Yeah. With the smaller items, how do I keep those, Sarah, from looking too cluttery or too much? Yes. Yeah, so this glass box down here. So we yeah. talked about how glass is also the trendy piece of the season. Mm -hmm. So the small glass display box, I didn't want to overwhelm the look. So I have it, you know, in its own area on the console with just a book and a little piece on top. Mm -hmm. um, this glass box over here, same thing, just kind of by itself, dainty. You don't have to put things in it. Mm -hmm. So with those small pieces, Contain just keep them. them. Yes, just keep, keep them, them simple. Contained. And we yeah. hear odd numbers are our friend when it comes to decorating. Yeah. Is that true with the smaller pieces? I like too? it. I like the threes. Yeah. Yeah. Any yeah. other trends in the shop right now that you are just loving? So with glass, it's the shape. So when you're picking out these glass faces, mm -hmm. look for the shape. Like this fun shape right here. Oh, cute. So we can just swap it out. Yes. 
with these amber vases. It doesn't take a lot, does it, to turn it over doesn't. a space or a vignette? It doesn't. And then here's some of these cloches that we're loving. Darling. So you can put something that really speaks to you with the season, like these little pumpkins for fall. And there it is again, under glass. It's almost like a yes. picture frame, isn't it, for those decor pieces? Yes. How cute. And then we have another little guy with an acorn. I notice you're bringing them in in pairs. Yep. I like the bigger with the smaller. These are darling. I know. So you can, cute. You can put some fun Halloween pieces within or mm -hmm. even switch it out for Christmas when the time comes. Okay. And then, again, with glass, oh, you can favorite. texture. Look at those. Yeah. These are so pretty. Look at those. So we'll switch these out. And we are all about the fun seasonal stems uh -huh. over at Grove. So we have these pretty fall stems. Let's put them right in. Play with it, bend it, Look make it full, that. little full. Look at that. Yeah. Are you always topping off or stuffing? Are you always using stems in your vases or would you ever leave them? You don't alone? have to. It kind of depends what you have going on. So right okay. here, I don't have anything high over here. Mm -hmm. So I want to balance that out. So some fun stems give you that height. Mm -hmm. But let's say I had a really tall lamp on the one side of my console table. You could ditch the stems. Okay, so, got it, got yeah. it. Well, with glass, I think the big takeaway is, as you've emphasized, look for colors. Look for colors. Look for shape. Uh huh. I had no idea, though, texture was yeah. on the shopping list. That Those are yes. my favorite. Those are gorgeous, that And pair. different shapes. So you have the different shapes. I love so. it. I love it. Yeah. Okay, we heard you're having a really fun party. Tell me about the upcoming event at Grove Collective. So we have an annual fall social. So at our store, we this is when we launch our Christmas decor. Oh my gosh. And outside in the parking lot, we have tables of curated Christmas and fall decor. Yeah. Our Christmas trees that are curated to different looks. And you could come shop. We have food trucks, vendors. It is a party. That you don't want to miss like it. That like a party. Yeah. When is it happening? It is on the 23rd and 24th. Okay. Yeah. Details on your website? Yep. Yep, yep. And our Instagram, Instagram Grove Collective Home. Okay. Thank you so much for the inspiration. Yeah. Just seeing your brain at work and also seeing the different possibilities when it comes to this new fall trendy combination yes. of rattan and glass. Thanks so much. You're Sarah. welcome. Thank you.